Jak się masz? Today I would like to show you a special place. A place not many of you know about. I didn't even know. It's you can say at the top of the Exmoor National Park. Uh, next to the road going next to Porlock Hill. When the Linton Porlock Road start going down to Porlock. And basically I stopped at the crossroad. I took a offshoot from that road, uh, which is road going to export. You cannot see that from the road. You cannot really see that from the hills around. And here we are. You see the water body behind me? That's not scale reservoir. As you can see, plenty of ponies around. <laughs> Just a few minutes ago, they were very interested. <laughs> this buzzing thing flying around. That's the reservoir. It has been created, if I could remember, about uh, 1920s or 30s. And it's supposed to serve as a reservoir for uh, drinking water for a mine head and porlock as well. After the year 2000, uh, they discover some substance in it. I mean, it's nothing, uh, nothing uh, dangerous. It's a substance. I forgot the name of it, really. But it's something that exists in nature. Is a Aromatic, one of the aromatic carbohydrates you can smell, for example, after the, uh, as soon as the rain comes down, down after the drought. People are very sensitive for that, and they, it's pretty much as they describe on Wiki, Wiki, uh, Wikipedia. It's a, it's a stuff that just smell and taste like a soil. So that has been discovered in the water and people complain about the water so right now Minehead and Porlock is supplied uh, with the water from the grid and the reservoir has been left just in a case to serve if something happens with the water from the grid tracks to navigate those hills today. Hello pony. Are you not scared me? Ooh. Hello ponies. It's a whole lot of you in here. Let's use that pony truck. Oh, you can see one of the tiny tributaries we crossing right now. So yeah, it's just a little tiny streams of water dripping down from the moors, really.
Hello, my pony friend. And our favorite gorse, oi! Think we might find out on wrong side. Yes. Okay. Just got a little accident. <laughs> that was a that was a bit tricky. Try to get to the front of the dam. Mm. Looks like there is no way. Hello. Excuse me. Yeah, I don't know. I I was trying to get into the reservoir, but I can see the. From the other side only. The whole area. Hold the reservoir, yes. Oh. You can't go in there. If you go in there, people think you're poaching. Or trying to poach. And uh, well, I got a channel on YouTube and I'm just filming around Devon. Yeah, but Nut Scale Reservoir is privately owned. This piece of land here, yeah. above the reservoir, is privately owned. I'm here from checking stock, checking ponies. Okay. Right, so the farmer, if he can't find me in here, say, oh, hi, because he knows me. But if he found you in here, he'd say, uh, you realise you're on private land, so you need to be outside of the fence of here. Okay. I'm not in there. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> so I need to come back now, up there. Yeah. Which way did you come in? Through the open Well, gate? I just parked in the lay-by, the first lay-by there. On the top? Uh, yeah, and I just walked. walked. down through the open gate? Yes. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, ponies shouldn't be in here either, but I'm keeping an eye on them. Because <laughs> I own some of them. Okay. Yeah, but the reservoir you can't get into. Ah, okay. So it's owned by Wessex Water and only those who are part of the fishing syndicate pay a lot of money each year to go in there to fish because it's stocked. So okay, it's good to know, you know, before yeah. I break any more laws. Absolutely. <laughs> Thank you very much. And also if you don't know the land you get stuck in logs very easily as well. Alright, so as we just learned, we are pretty much on the private land and we shouldn't be here. What more? The whole reservoir is a private and you cannot anyway to get here. <sighs> the only way is after getting a permit. 
so I guess my only option left will be to film it from the drone as soon as I get back on a private I mean on a public land come on guys make a room Oh, we're getting up. Hello pony Stupid Who thinks I'm about to give up I'm just going to find another way uh, There is... I can see there is a road and the bus parks on a road and it's closer closer, closer point from my place of parking to fly a drone so I'm just going back to the car I'm gonna investigate where from where that road goes and then I make a decision if I'm going there or not I got one idea but I do know a few local roads in here but basically there is not a lot of roads going over the moors uh, between the Porlock, Porlock Lin, Linton and Linmonth Road and the other road that goes through Simons Bath, Exford all the way to the Weddon Cross so yeah I just need to I just need my road atlas consultation and I will and I will know if I'm going there or not As you can see, we're not so far from reservoir and yeah, nothing reveals it's there. All right, so I'm on the other side right now. The lady told me you cannot get here because it's all private, but I can see there is a sign saying public bridal way. It doesn't exactly say here, but well, let's try. Quite a big disadvantage of Exmoor National Park is that in majority it's owned by private, o private owners <coughs> that's why you can easily trespass like I ju just did today uh, you can see down there this is right on the path of the water from the reservoir there is a farm somebody has a nice little cottage
and here it is, the dam. I don't want to really stretch the boundaries today as at the car park where I parked there was a coach which tells me there are some people with the guide from the Holnikot estate who probably paid for that tour and I'm just curious if they won't have any anything against me being here on my own and for free so I guess I just have to find a nice place to start a drone
much as I can. I'm flying hidden in a, in a gorse bushes. Just, just next to the road, as you can see. That was the nut scale reservoir. Apparently completely private and I shouldn't be even here, but I don't know. I mean, there is a normal legal road. There is no sign saying it's a private no entry or whatever. So yeah, at least you 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 get the chance to see it a little bit. Uh, this is as much as I want to take a risk, you know, before somebody spot me, and I will get into trouble. So <laughs> I see you in the next episode. High five!